Welcome to the weekly Wednesday news summary from Krakow, let's start. Once again, there will be no grand New Year's Eve party on the main square. There will also be no municipal New Year's Eve events on Podzorski Square and in the Rose Avenue. Nevertheless, the people of Krakow are organizing themselves on forums and social media to welcome the new year on the main square. As they say, we'll have a party our way. Another popular place to spend New Year's Eve is the Krakus Mound. On the last day of the year, for the 19th time, the streets of the old town will be filled with crowds of costumed runners, participants of the Krakow New Year's Run. The proceeds from the event will be donated to the Foundation for the Support of Pediatric Heart Surgery Shola Cordis. There will be two routes, 5 and 10 kilometers. The start, December 31st, at noon, and finish will be at the small market square. A specially appointed jury will award financial and material prizes to the authors of the most imaginative costumes. Almost 1,000 people have signed up for the run. Already tomorrow, December 28 at 4 p.m., the traditional carol procession will depart from Ridlufka. Subsequently, a special holiday tram will transport all participants to the city center. Carol singing on the main square stage is scheduled for 5.30 p.m. During this event, carolers from Bronowice, who joined the procession, will also participate. Until January 7, you can see a modest but charming live nativity scene at 8 Boshiana Street in Krakow. Right next to it is a restaurant canteen where you can eat on the spot or take away a variety of Polish dishes. As this is the last episode of 90 Seconds What's Up Krakow News this year, wishing you a year ahead filled with laughter, love, and exciting adventures. Thank you for everything this past year, looking forward to seeing you in 2024. See you next Wednesday. Ciao.